this? What is this? <laughs> Maybe it's a board. Who knows? Maybe it's some kind of skateboard. You guys are going to see what this is before me. Cardboard. It says, Hi, Jonah. I wanted to say how much I love your work. Skate and Way of the House Husband came out at a very hard time in my life, but both really helped out. Enjoy the poster. It's double-sided. Is this a Love Live poster? Oh, wait. Oh, Bam! Yeah, it's not Love Live, is it? It's, it's a Matcha Blossom poster. There are big anime titties right here. Let's open Flash Casey's package. Recently, I was venturing in ancient and forgotten cities and found a relic, a relic of awesome power and strength, one in which I had the package in triple layers so that I could ship it through the U USPS. Now, I had to contain the relic. Ancient relic, chat. There's some serious juju in here, all right? Okay, let's see what this ancient relic is. We have to exhume the relic. We have no other option. Christ on the cracker, this thing's heavy. Oh, look. Oh, look. A DVD. <laughs> oh, my God. <laughs> <laughs> That's what it says on the foil. Quad reliquum apiad omnis peto forita. Sidium sidium infectore. The mark of the slayer. All right, let's figure out what's inside here. What is this? What is this? <laughs> what the did you put a shoe in an acrylic cast? Is this a resin cast shoe? <laughs> what on God's green earth is this? Is this your shoe? Is this your shoe, Flash Case? Yes, it is. I'll give you guys a better look. What the fuck? It's beautiful. It's, it's kind of like, it's kind of serene in a way, you know? Holy shit. You're very right. It, it's very sticky. What the fuck? This is weird. This is cursed. Friend of Flash Case, I'm sorry. <laughs> Thank you for the $10 dodo. I taught him how to cast it. So I thought I should send the lithogram. P.S. It looks better when you're looking at it from the smooth side. It's like suspense. Hold on. Let me, let me go show my roommates quick. I show that to my roommate. And the first thing he says, he's like, that was probably really expensive to mail. <laughs> Regardless of how silly this is, thank you so much for taking the time to, for, to make a meme with me. These are nice shoes. All right, I'm going to put this. Oh, look, you zip tied the laces down. I just noticed that. That's insane. All right, I'm going to put it over next to your brick. In case you guys didn't know, Flashcase also literally sent me a brick. Like, as weird as it is, I love it. You don't understand. Like, I, I love this shit. I think this shit is hilarious. I love the surprise and the unboxing and like, just, I, I love it. We have one more package. And I think this one is rather special, if I do say so myself. <clears throat> all right, let's open this up. There's a lot of mustaches on here. You like the mustaches? Oh my gosh. Look at all the packaging. Mmm. Mmm, it's that package smell. Whoa, first of all, big surprise here. Big surprise. Got yourself a nice big old package of some of them Swedish fish. I love me those those raging red fish, dude. My favorite. I love Swedish fish. Are you thinking what I'm thinking? Are you thinking what I'm thinking? Oh, baby. This is a straight up skateboard. Check this out. Are you fucking kidding me, bro? It's a Joe skateboard. And you know what that means? I can't do it inside, but there is a kickflip in y'all's future. You guys ready to get it? You got a kickflip? Huh? I could try an impossible, but there's a kickflip in y'all's future. Give you guys a close up here. It's beautiful. I, you have to skate on stream now? I mean, I can't. It's literally been forever since I've been on a skateboard. It's been about 10 years. Oh, and you loosened the trucks too, dude. I'm not going to do it inside. It looks hand painted, man. It's literally been forever since I've been on a skateboard, but I'm going to bare toes the skateboard. Yeah. Got it, man. There it is, guys. There's more stuff in here. Whoa, how did this sneak past me? How the fuck did that sneak past me? Thank you so much for the Sour Patch Kids too. Now you got things to make me fat tonight. the good shit huh oh guys you know what it sounds like when you drop that chicken in the deep fryer you know what it sounds like when you you got to take a really a really a really thick piss oh what is this is this an otter stoat combo this is cute that's so that's so nice we need to make a t-shirt like this lewis if you're here would you mind writing down the quotes below in the included card stock mailing them back I'd like to get them tattooed. And I thought it'd be super cool to have them done in your handwriting. No shit. My God. Yeah, sure. Of course. Okay. This one says, read me. 
You're welcome to read on stream, but fair warning, it's a little sappy. That's what we like here. Okay. That's the shit we like here. Okay. All right. Hey, Jonah. Hope all is going well and things aren't too crazy. I'm writing this while watching your stream. And things seem they have been busy lately. This is true. I have been busy lately. I recently delved into Skate the Infinity and it inspired me to give you skateboarding, to give skateboarding another go. Busted my ass the first time 101. Dude, you will fall like out of a hundred times you try and do a kickflip, you will do three of them. That is my, that is my metric. When you're learning, at least. Joe quickly became my comfort character. Okay, yes, partly because he's big ass titties and, and their titties are 15 out of 10, but also because he feels like the kind of character who would hug you when you were sad. Like your dad. So thank you for bringing him into my life that way. All that said, and not to get too sappy, I struggle with depression. Me too. And anxiety. Me too. And I know how much they can suck. So it broke my heart when you mentioned that you used to hate yourself. I, I did. Uh, you're clearly a kind soul and your chaotic content uh, and wonderful sense of humor have made me laugh so much in the last few weeks i'm so grateful this last year has been a bit of a nightmare between covid and my mom passing away i'm sorry to hear that i'm sorry to hear that i've been there but coming into this summer i slowly feel like i'm figuring out how to live again yeah that's that's exactly what it feels like a part of that i hadn't anticipated playing such a big role is skating and in all honestly i didn't think i'd have given it another go if not for skate the infinity sometimes finding reasons to laugh or smile is kind of a struggle these days but skate and these chaotic vids from your streams have been both something I can fall back on when life feels like it's kicking me in the teeth. I know firsthand how hard it is it can be when dealing with depression, but I hope you know and remember that you're a wonderful, amazing person and that you're more than what your darkest thoughts will tell you you are. I hope you enjoy the skateboard. I figured maybe picking it back up could bring a smile to your face like skating has done for me when I'm not falling on my ass. The graphic on the bottom is hand painted and I sealed it uh, so it should hold up fairly well. I put the trucks and wheels on grip tape on myself. That's amazing, you did. You loosened the trucks for me. You loosened the trucks for me. And I really appreciate that. When you buy a stock skateboard, the trucks are so tight. Ugh, you can't turn at all. Remember, you can go wherever you want. It's a freaking revelation, a world of possibility. That was a recce quote. Thank you and all the best, it's Cooks. This is my first time assembling a board. So if you do decide to test it out, please be careful. Otherwise, please feel free to use it as a cool art piece. <laughs> Thank you so much. I love you guys. Thank you. I I don't know what to say. You guys are always so sweet to me. And I don't really feel like I do too much other than just be myself on a stream. You know what I mean? And just hearing that it, 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 it has affected you guys so much, it makes me feel this overwhelming responsibility to continue to be myself, if that makes sense. No matter what happens in the next year, however big this stream gets, however, however, however much we fall off, I'm here for you guys. And you are the reason I'm streaming. I'm not streaming to, to be famous. I'm not streaming for the money. <laughs> I'm, I'm streaming because I like to entertain you guys. I love you guys very much. And yes, things have been very busy lately. Um, I have been working a lot, but that's good because you know what? The best part about the fact that me working so much is that there is that much more and then some that I can bring to you guys. Every role that I book, every game that I'm in, every game we play together, every voice actor that we work with and bring on stream is for you. I started the stream as kind of a way to vlog. Um, before my mom passed away, I she had given me the idea to do like professional vlogs where I would get on YouTube and I would talk to you guys and I would say, today I did this and I auditioned uh, for a cartoon and this is how it went and like obviously omitting very specific details but this stream kind of turned into that where it's like look at I can't talk to you about it but in a, in about two weeks we're gonna have something exciting to do you know like Critical Role has things like there are a few other voice actors that stream every couple of weeks but I want to be the guy that is as close to the fans as possible and uh, I think we're doing a pretty good job <laughs> Please be excellent to everyone you meet because everyone is fighting a hard battle and sometimes and sometimes you can't see it. Thank you so much for being here and thank you so much for the skateboard and the shoe and the memes and the Swedish fish and the good vibes. 